Hello everyone and welcome back to Dynamics Academy. This is yet another video in a feature a day video series. In this video series we will cover the new features that were released with Microsoft Dynamics 365 9.0 version. On your screen you are able to see the various new features that were released in 9.0 version of Dynamics 365. We will see each of these feature in detail per video in this series. And at the same time we will also see the various deprecations that are going to happen with Dynamics 365 9.0 version release. So this series is going to be very much useful and informative. So let us now see the feature that we are going to cover in this video. In today's video we will see yet another deprecation that has been announced by Microsoft which is Parach or Knowledge Base. My name is Abhishek Turiya and I will be your host in this video. I will first walk you through what is Parach your knowledge base, when it was introduced in Dynamics 365 and what will be the way forward going ahead. So let us now without wasting much of your time start this video after this short intro. agenda for this video is pretty much simple first I will show you what was the situation till now where I will give you an overview and background of what was Microsoft Paracho and then we will see what is replacing Paracho knowledge base and at the end we will see the list of useful references and resources that we have used while preparing this video series which might be useful to you as well. So let us now begin with first understanding what was Microsoft Paracho. Microsoft Paracho is a cloud based customer engagement solution that enterprises can deploy to provide self-service capabilities to their customers. And Microsoft has acquired Parachur in January 2014 and has since then fired Parachur Cloud Solution with its Microsoft Dynamics CRM systems to give enterprises additional ways of enhancing their customers' experiences and brand support, while also providing more flexibility for customers to connect with the enterprises. So this was an overall overview about what was Microsoft Parachur when it was introduced in Dynamics 360 and what it used and what is the purpose that serves within Dynamics CRM. But now, Microsoft has announced that usage of Parachur knowledge base as knowledge management solution is deprecated. So with Dynamics 365 version 9.0, it is going to be deprecated in a future major release. Let us now see what is replacing Paracho. This feature is replaced by knowledge base management feature in Dynamics 365 customer service. Knowledge solution settings in the knowledge base management settings dialog box which provides a connection to Paracho will be removed in the future major release. So you, when you navigate to knowledge solutions area, you still see Paracho as an option. But going forward, it is going to be removed and deprecated from this place. So let me now show you where exactly and how exactly you can navigate to this place. So this is the home page or the landing page of my Dynamics 365 trial instance. In order to navigate to knowledge based management settings, you need to click this gear icon and click on advanced settings. By default, you will land on the business management settings area. You need to click this arrow icon and see here the service management settings. Under the service management settings, you need to navigate to the knowledge base management area. Click on this embedded knowledge search and it will open up the knowledge base management settings dialog box that I have showed you in the previous slide. So right now, till this date, you can still connect to Parach your knowledge base as your knowledge solution. But going forward, it is going to be removed and deprecated from this place. So this is the exact place you will notice the change. I seen that let us now see what are the useful references that we have used while preparing this video series we will put all these links in our description box as well and on that note I take your leave I thank you for watching this video till the end so if you have learned something new out of this video then please like share and subscribe to Dynamics Academy and also do not forget to press the bell icon so that you will never miss any update whenever we release a new video into our Dynamics Academy YouTube channel. So on that note, 
I take your leave and hope to see you all in the next video. Till then, bye-bye and take care.